Hello everyone and welcome back. I am the Walking Taco. Thank you for joining me today. Sorry about the really short episode last time. Um, the lady that comes in and cleans our room for our uh, that's hired by our university uh, came in my room and started vacuuming. So I was just like, well, I can't record a video while there's vacuuming. So I decided to just, you know, uh, let her do that and come back to you guys. So I will make this a longer part because the last part wasn't very long. So we're just going to get right into it. So I was just about to sell her, and I think that's what I'll do. And then I'm going to sell him back, and we're going to make some money here. And then we're just going to let these sieges happen. This siege happen anyways. And then we're going to go back and stop him from sieging as well. So we'll... Things are going okay-ish for us. Um, yeah, there's nothing really else say as of right now so I'm just gonna siege this I don't I haven't seen his army anywhere so it leads me to believe that he doesn't have an army or it's all the way over here doing something I'm not sure what but you'll find out eventually and then I'm going to go stop him from attacking us um, Yeah, attack him here. Try not to get a river crossing. I don't think there is any between here and there. Um, but there is one there. But it looks like this is what we'll have to do in order to stop him. And we crushed that guy's army. And so we're just going to come here and re-siege and start sieging this as well. Boom. We can assault this, so that's what I'm going to do. Gallery has become... Lollard, everything's looking pretty good for us right now. Um, yeah. And we can assault here, so that's what I'm going to do. And boom. This war is shaping up to be really good for us. We might get this duchy, we might not. But I'm hoping that we do, because I really want this duchy for us. We are 57 years old, so we're getting up there in age. And another... This place has become Lollard. Everything's becoming Lollard. It's pretty good. But, we are getting up there in age. We were born on January 1st, 866. So, we shouldn't, we shouldn't be around too much longer. And then we can pass on the rulership to our um, niece and eventually her son. I'm about to sneeze. Hold on a second. Alright, I'm back. Sorry. I had a sneeze. That was bad. Um, is there anyone else you could talk to, dude? Because I don't need you to talk to her anymore. Um, you can talk to him. He doesn't really like us too much. Hopefully, the Pope will not declare a um, crusade for us. Because the Pope has been known to declare crusades on heretic nations. Which is less than ideal. But we're going to hopefully not have that happen to us. And the Crusader Kings. The very heartlands of Western Christianity are under siege by infidels. Desperate Christian lords have persuaded His Holy Holiness, Pope something, the second, to declare his intentions of forging a great and righteous alliance to accept, expel the heathens in the name of God. This signals a new era of large-scale Christian holy wars, the Crusades. Deus boot. Teutonic Order. Knights of St. John. San, Knights of San Diego. Knights of Calavantra. So the Christian holy war orders are being formed and the Christian Jihad, I mean not Jihad, Crusades will be beginning soon. Which means that we might possibly see the end of our nation. But hopefully what will happen is I become a Catholic right in the nick of time. Right when everything seems lost for us. So... Hopefully we can remain Lollard as long as possible. 
I don't remember how this happened, to be honest. It just kind of happened. We became a heretic, and now everyone hates us. We're going to destroy this Burgundian army here, and we're going to get some great war score. Only 10 war score, but that's okay. We're going to go to Lorraine and get some more war score for us. And... 82 war score and his army is not defeated yet so we're gonna go try to take out his army and let me just take the timer I keep on hearing people outside my door it's weird <clears throat> and I'm just gonna crush his army here alright he's still not defeated this is insane is there anyone else at war? no he's only at war with me at least that's what I think is going on. And he just hired a holy order to try to stop me, but that won't stop me. I will destroy his holy order and get some more war score. Because if I defeat this enough, they will start to surrender to me. So Burn... And then eventually, I'm just going to come up here after I'm done with him, and hope that we can defeat him. There's a lot of stuff going on right now. Oh, we're ill. Oh, we're going to die. We're so going to die. Population of Liege is becoming Catholic, or Lollard, I mean. So we're a nice Lollard heresy up here. And there is some Lollard being spread to Aquitaine, which is good. Oh, I'm good. Thank you, though. Sorry, guys. That was the same lady again. She really wants to clean my room for me. I really appreciate that from her. Hopefully, with about one more siege or something like that, we can end this war. And hopefully we'll become... Get this nice Lollard heresy spreading up here as well. <coughs> Excuse me. Crusade for Aquitaine, that's horrible. We might lose Aquitaine, guys. But that's okay, because we will have a claim on Aquitaine if he does lose. And he wants us to join. Oh no, this is bad. Force demands. Is there any chance that you'll give up, Mr. Dude? Nope, okay. Looks like we will be part of this crusade. But hopefully we do end this war with Burgundy here really soon and looks like not too many people are joining like not too many big powers are joining on the side of the Pope which is good and if we need to we will hire some mercenaries just so that way we can try to keep this kingdom down here Lollard she my wife Let's engage with me in theological debate. Bring it on, woman. I am awesome. And now she is Lollard. She's Bosk and Lollard. Okay, one more tick. And we're at a thousand wars. I mean, 100%. My bad. And we win. So now I'm going to make this stuff into the things we need it to be. Then I'm going to give away the land. Uh, keep on having nose problems. It's really, uh, my allergies, excuse me, are starting to act up. So, yes. Alright, and then I'm just going to give it out to one person because I don't feel like dealing with that right now. Not married, not a ruler, not a great house. <laughs> Yes, an adult. Yes, my culture. And yes, my religion. And we're going to go with the highest steward person. And then we're just going to give him all the land. So the Duchy of Lower Lorraine is yours. Have at it, dude. And we are not close to um, making the HRE. I just want to see how close we could are. We're about 36% of the way there. Which isn't so bad. But I'm going to release and re-raise here. 
Because we can get way more troops than we actually have. We're all going to go there. Okay, now it's time to see who joined on the side of the Pope. Okay. So not too many people. We could actually defeat these people very easily. Especially with our large army. So, yeah, we'll do that. Oh, and this just became part of Burgundy? What? How did part of my... What? I don't understand what happened. That's okay. Bird of Lorraine. So apparently Burgundy somehow managed to measle, weasel their way into a new duchy uh, up into our lands. Not really sure how they did it, but they did. Yeah, there's no way we can defeat these people in this war. Unless we play it really, really smart, but I don't know if we can. Looks like we might lose all of Aquitaine. You will become deceitful. Okay, I'm going to put somebody else in charge. Like me. I'm not going to go anywhere close to the Pope's army. Because that's just way too much for us. We gain 100 prestige, which is good. I'm going to see if there's a river crossing into Toulouse from where we are. Perigord, yes there is. Looks like there's a river that flows everywhere in Toulouse, so we're just going to go here. We're just going to have to risk it. Looks like they are going to join troops. Looks like we are going to lose, so... That is alright. I knew we were going to lose this, but we'll just pull out and we'll save our troops. My culture has died of smallpox. You're imprisoned. That's less than ideal. The Teutonic Order is in charge of that. So, it looks like we will have to become Catholic here really soon. But I will get 145 gold from him. Yeah, there's just no way that we can contend with this, so I'm just going to drop the mercenaries, and we're just going to go back home. Alright, so we're just going to walk back home and become Catholic. And we'll gain 200 piety for doing this, so that's, it just seems like the best option for us right now. Um, I mean, after this holy war, we'll become um, Catholic again. But if they start sieging my stuff, then I will just become Catholic immediately, and hopefully that should get us out of the war. Court chaplain died. That's less than ideal. You're really good. I'm gonna improve re religious relations with nobody. I'm gonna study culture tech in our capital. My chancellor died, which is also less than ideal. <clears throat> Yay, you're my new chancellor. I'm gonna make the Pope like me more. As odds are he hates me. Yes. My niece's guardian is no longer a guardian of him. So we'll get her trained up by a this kind of guy. I don't know. I'm gonna have to become a Lawler leave the Lord Heresy soon 
I'm actually gonna do it now. I am now Catholic. And I just made my wife not, so this is interesting. Of course, my daughter-in-law, I mean my niece, is in fact Lollard, so we're gonna have to do this again. And she is pregnant with another man's baby. Okay, who doesn't like me now? Everyone's not too fond of me. I can understand why. I don't need the Brabant title. So I'm going to give it to somebody that likes me a lot. I'm going to give you the Duchy of Brabant. And you're going to become Catholic with me. And... Can you become Catholic? No, but... Now you can. Alright, let me see how we're doing on time. <clears throat> we're doing great with time. Can you become... Lollard, I mean, a uh, Catholic as well. Can you become... Oh, wait, you're getting taught by somebody. I'll actually arrange for you to be taught by a Catholic man. Somebody that's decent. Actually, it doesn't matter to me because you're not my kid. Okay, I'll make you like me more before I do that. Now will you? It's really good stats. And then the guy of clone, you love me, you'll become well, uh, not a heretic. You love me, you're not a heretic. You hate, you love me too. Wow, that's really cool. You're not a heretic anymore. You're not a heretic anymore. It's like I'm Oprah or something. Like, you get a car, you get a car, you get a car. Everyone gets a car! That's my uh, Oprah impression. It's not very good, I know. But, you know, I tried. Um, will my court chaplain... Now he will. 16? Yeah, you are way better. Or not. I wanted this guy. Apparently I can't choose a new spy master for whatever reason. So I guess I'm just gonna have to stick with the guy I got. Um that's weird. Then you you like me decently. Will you become nope, you will not become a Lollard with me. All the money that we made from the the guy that we imprisoned is going towards this because I want to make sure everyone on my court is a Lollard with me so that's what all the money is going towards you do not like that I'm not Lollard but I will give you a woman yeah you can become you can get married to that girl Everyone's becoming Catholic. Yes, you like me more now. Okay, now let's give you Seneschal, more money, and a religious conversion. Everyone's becoming Catholic. We were heretics, but now we're not. <clears throat> and hopefully okay, so our niece is in Francis court okay who, where is she at okay so she's just there invite to court yes that's awesome it's her and her husband in my court awesome so I'm gonna send a gift to you. You become not a Lollard. You will never become not a Lollard, so we'll work on you later. And now you have a boy with this guy. I don't want you to be married to this guy, so I'm gonna actually kill him. Nobody likes him. 
which is awesome. Even she doesn't like him. She's going to help us kill her husband. You know, the usual. And then you're just going to get released. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to create this kingdom. It should have the same succession as the current kingdom that we have. Well, actually, I'm going to wait on that. I'm going to let my heir do that. Because I don't think that it's my place to really do that. King Rudolph did expand the uh, borders of Holland quite a bit. Diedrich. Yes. Oh, you need to be the right religion. Okay. You're the right religion. Your husband needs to be the right religion. Um, the, the Duke of Luxembourg is my grandson. He doesn't like me very much. Okay. He died, which is good. Okay, we need a matrilineal marriage. Okay, or not. Alright, so our heir needs a matrilineal marriage. Oh, we're at war with everyone, that's why we can't do it. At this point, my grandson should just give up. I mean, there's no way that we can contend with all of these people. My cousin, uh, Carling. Yeah, so there's nothing we can really do right now. Okay, I'm going to actually have you start converting things back. That was our wild teen years for this kingdom. We just wanted to experiment with some heresy. Wait, are you Lollard? The Kingdom of Burgundy is now Lollard. This is hilarious. Someone's got a claim on me. Let me just see how we're doing militarily. Alright, our levies are going to take a while to replenish. Denmark is quite large still. My daughter is unmarried. She, I mean, not my daughter, my niece. But eventually we will hopefully be getting um, uh, back in our kingdom so we can train him not to be Lollard anymore. In fact, what is his... He's still Dutch. He's being trained by a Aquitanian, which is less than ideal. <clears throat> yes. I want her to be with us. That was weird that she wasn't. Okay, and then we'll see if we can get her matrilineally married to anyone. No, we cannot. Peasant leader. This guy's zealous. He's Catholic. 
get her married to that guy. That'll be a good king. Who else do you have? Stop taking my people. Gosh. Better not use it. They're gonna use it. They all, they always use it. Basically, they keep on getting claims on me, and they're, I'm like, oh, they better not use it. But they always end up using it. So, corn. So we got enough troops. I want to see how big the Carling Empire is now. Okay, Carling only has these three kingdoms now. Which is awesome. And they're not even at war with somebody to put it in. In Carling, at least I don't think they are. They're not Carling. I'm really happy about this. The Car We were the ones that kind of helped with the follow the Carling Empire and we want to make her gregarious she did become gregarious I feel like we should probably create this kingdom I don't know probably create it with the next person yeah, she'll do I'll, I'll create the kingdom with her we have 2,000 prestige. <clears throat> kind of want to see the history of the rulers. So, King Bujulin the Wise, and then King Rudolf the, of Holland. We are not anything else other than just the King of Holland. Really tired of these raiders. There's nothing I can do about them. Yeah, this po this is about to end. I'm not crusading, no, because I used to be Lollard, but now I'm a Catholic. The, the next holy war, I definitely will crusade. <clears throat> I'm wondering who's gonna actually take over Aquitaine after this. 27% for the Teutonic Order. Looks like the Teutonic Order is gonna become the leader of Aquitaine. As of right now, anyways. Siege equipment. We lost. But praise the Lord, I think. Oh, so West Francia gained all this. Wait, what? West Francia, the pagan. The Lollard King of West Francia gained back his holdings in West Francia. That literally makes zero sense. Oh well, whatever. We're 62 years old. Our wife hates us. Which I think I can understand why. We told her to become a Lollard. She became a Lollard and then we became a Christian again. So, you know how it works. 
she just wants us to be consistent, you know? <clears throat> Who's the person of, love, of this place? Am I still allied with you? I'm allied with Aquitaine, and that's it. Oh, you're still the king of Aquitaine. I mean, it's not as much land as it used to be. Alright, but that looks like that's all the time we have for today. I have been the Walking Taco. Thank you for joining me today. And as always, have a great day and comment, like, and subscribe even if you didn't like what you, said, what you saw here. And yeah, have a great day. Bye-bye.